Hi, Steve here. I wanted to talk with you a little bit about storing your barrel. Now, once your oak barrel has uh, already had liquor in it or it's already been cured, it's already had water or liquor soaked into the wood, you'll want to keep water or liquor in your barrel at all times. Uh, and the reason is, is because the liquor, the liquid, the water has soaked into the wood and it has caused the wood to swell and create pressure against the bands. Once the water evaporates or liquor evaporates out of the wood, then it will contract. And the next time you put liquid in it, it could leak and it may not be able to be stopped. So that's one of the reasons, one of the most important things we tell you about care and about storing your barrel is that just keep it wet on the inside. So what you'll want to do is once the barrel has been cured, once you've started to use it and you've got enough liquor, you don't really need to age or flavor anymore and you want to uh, take a break, so to speak, or if you want to kind of clean the previous liquor out of the wood between batches, then put water in it. So you can put water in there for three or four days, pour it out, put it in there for three or four days again, and cycle that through, and that'll clean the, any residual liquor out of the wood, but also, too, just storing it. So if you're going to store it for a few weeks or a few months, and, uh, of course, they always look nice looking on your, uh, your shelf there or your bar at home, then uh, it's real easy to do. Just put water in it and top it off every few weeks, open the bung, Make sure there's water all the way to the top because there will be a little bit of evaporating going on. And that's the simplest way. With that type of care and storing, these barrels will last you for years. And you'll be very satisfied with the quality that you'll get from them. So that's it for now. We'll see you next time.